The City of London is constantly thriving with new inventions, and the latest company to pave the way is pioneering Barnsbury firm Shadow Robot Company. Behind its rather nondescript exterior on Liverpool Road, the business's products have been recognised around the world. The robot hand, which costs between £50,000 and £100,000, has been bought by NASA and the Ministry of Defence to carry out dangerous or repetitive tasks. It was recently among 120 UK exhibitors to showcase at an Innovate UK event last month. Shadow is a, a robot company, we're a UK SME. We build various robot products, mainly we're best known for building hands for robots, not for humans, actually putting human-like hands on the front of, of robots. The Innovate UK project started last year, finished this year. King's College London and us worked together to get this 3D vision holding and understanding how we're holding objects to work. Innovate is always a good way to meet future partners, future collaborators. Partly we're there because it's a good way to meet people with problems. Um, the people you get at an event like Innovate are people who are thinking about technology, thinking about the use of technology to, to solve problems. One of its latest projects is to use the hand for strawberry picking. For that, we've been building robot hands for years, we're now starting to build a an ecosystem around that in sort of tools, techniques, technologies to make it useful. Um, and one of those is another project funded by Innovate UK, which is developing, looking to develop a robot to pick strawberries. Nobody wants to pick strawberries. It's not a very well paid job. Um, it's fairly mind-numbingly tedious work, you know, and there aren't many people in the UK who want to do it. We have, and we only have one project running from them at the moment, but we also have some European funding. So I'd say about a third of our our income is R&D projects funded by Europe or Innovate UK. Uh, about a third of it is contract engineering work for clients, and about a third of it is selling the products that we make ourselves. Tanvir Man, Islington Now.